Lexicoptanicon. So we've crafted our pure daisies and we're making lots and lots of living rock and living wood. So what is next for us? Runic altars. Runic com creation is a rather important complex in the advancement of the botanical magics. First and foremost, though, this type of crafting requires a decent knowledge of mana manipulation. Before, ding, before proceeding further, a read through the most a read through the important entries, those in italics, on that section of the Lexica Botanica might prove enlightening. Okay, let's go back and let's go mana manipulation and introduction to mana. Mana is an erythral substance. In layman's terms, it's a form of mystical energy. In sensorial existence, it is constant, inconstant, and its living color depends on the environments it's put in. Mastering mana is one of the most important skills a botanist needs to master. In order to create mana, one would require a set of generating flowers. Read this respective sec section. This mana can be dispersed using mana spreaders and stored in mana pools. Mana can be used from myriad of different things. For starters, it can be used for functional flowers. Uh, so we need to look at generating flowers after we finish this. To get started with mastering the art of mana, one would use to learn day blooms, mana spreaders, and mana pools. These form a basic infrastructure for mana, which can be used for all sorts of purposes. Have a read at the functional flora and magical apparatus sections of the lexicon. So we need to look at day... I don't like that. We need to look at day blooms. So is that going to be in this set? No, it's not. So generating flora, and we wanted day blooms. The day bloom is the most basic and rudimentary generating flower. Sounds good. Simply put it, oh, it's like photosynthesis, but for collecting flowers. It's rather so, and about 10 of these should do, get the job done. 10 or a dozen. Let's make a dozen. Uh, they compete among themselves for sunlight, so we want them in any of the four cardinal directions will result. So we just need to put them pretty far away. They don't produce much to begin with. However, upgrading to endoflames might be good. We'll do that eventually. So they just need to go in a star pattern. Okay. And we craft them with a yellow, two yellows, an orange, and a light blue. So we're creating 12. So we're going to need six, right? Because we need a, they're four in total. So that means we're going to need 48 in total. So we know we need 12 yellow. Wow, it's a lot of yellows. And then we needed greens, I think. No, I think, oh, let's check. We need... Light blues and orange, not green. Okay, so where are the oranges? Right here, we need six. And it wanted light blue, so let's get six of those. Awesome. So let's craft these into their petals. And we should have the perfect... Ah, there we go. We'll have the perfect amount of them. And let's get our bucots out. Let's fill them with water. And let's go ahead and move them like this so it doesn't drive me insane bucket that's not what i meant okay i guess that worked one two one one and then we needed seeds and we're gonna need lots of seeds let's go grab some sweets not sweet seeds no okay bucket i blah. boom 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 okay we've made two out of six so, I think, I don't know how I want these permanently set up yet, but I think for now we may just do like a temporary solution to the problem. Like we'll just set up like, like what I did with the pure daisies. It'll just be like thrown together out for outside. And then maybe in between episodes, I'll spend some time cleaning it up. I think that'll be a good idea because I don't think you guys want to see me build more stuff on camera because I got kind of bored of it and I'm the one who's doing it. So that's not the best. I keep going back and I don't need to. But yeah, so I'll spend some time in between episodes just cleaning it up and I'll build a farm too and I may even work on some animal pens. I don't think I'm going to do a let's build. or You know what? I may do a let's build. I'm not sure yet. I'll If I do a let's build, it'll be on the channel. But if I don't, don't be angry. Okay, but yeah, that's how we'll get through this day bloom crisis. Okay, day blooms. Is it nighttime? No. Let's just go ahead and harvest up all this wood and all the living rock so we can just get this out of the way. I mean, honestly, we probably will have enough after 
harvesting this batch. Like we have 29 and we'll probably have about near that for the living wood. So I think I may just leave the daisies where they are. And yeah. Okay. So let's very quickly put down our day blooms. I think a pattern like this was okay. As long as they're not in the cardinal directions of each other, I think it was fine. We'll put, oh wait, that's not good. It needs to go here. It needs to go here and it needs to go here. Okay, let's go upstairs and sleep before they all get blown up by creep. Oh my god, the apothecary scared me. I thought it was some sort of super boss thing. Wait, let's go upstairs. Oh, and we got a seed too, I think. We had 52 when we finished crafting the day blooms. Good morning, rise and shine. What else can we say? Uh, Ola is high, but you, no one really like stands over you while you're sleeping and says Ola when you wake up. Like that's uh, particle effects. Oh, that looks really good. Okay, so we have our day blooms. Now let's go back to an introduction. No, we wanted to look at mana and an introduction to mana. So we also need, it can be dispersed by mana spreaders and stored in mana pools. So let's go ahead, don't like that. Where is it even sharing it? Link, click to see, I don't, maybe it shares it to the chat on a server or something and that's what it means, but I'm not sure other than that. How do I make a mana pool? Living, oh cool, we have tons of living rock, that's easy. So let's go, do I not have a, I don't have a crafting table up here. Wow, that's kind of surprising. I put crafting tables everywhere. Let's put one right here. Boom, we have another one. Let's take some living rock and let's put a diluted mana pool. And for now, we'll just put it here. It's not working. I guess I need the mana things first. So we'll just put it down here. I don't want barley seeds. And it also said we would need something else. You can press Q to drop. I don't want to do like a limited. I want to do a re a useful thing, like or not a useful, but a like sustainable thing with the day blooms. So a mana spreader. Point A to point B. Okay, so when this walk is placed on the ground, it'll face one of six directions by holding with a wand of the forest. Oh, I need to make one of those. In bind mode. So how do we make these mana spreaders with living wood, gold, and some shards? So let's go downstairs and cook some gold. I don't think I have any gold ingots. I think I only have the iron ingots. So let's take some of our... We have a stack of gold ore. Let's just cook a half of it, half of the stack. Then we'll split it up between furnaces so it cooks a bit faster. Okay, and now shards, I think I could use any. Yep, so which ones do we have the most of? We still have the most of these. Let's make eight of them. Right, do we have an- I don't think I have enough to do that actually. So let's go ahead and put some more oak wood down. And then after we put down this oak wood, I will investigate the wand of the forest, I think it was called. We'll have to make one of those because I did not find one of those while I was adventuring. Okay, so we needed a wand of the- forest holding a wand of the forest so how do we make that wand i don't see it here is it like in tools mystical items horns pastures rods terrestrial balls soul scribe that doesn't look right what about miscellaneous no i don't see it there uh, apparatus where would it be tiny planet that sounds cool mana manipulation is it here i oh, don't know i give up i'm just gonna use the nei if i can't find it we're using nei oh stupid numbers i don't like how you can click numbers at the top of the screen okay so wand not top of the screen the top of the oh this is cool so how do we craft these but I don't like how you can... Oh, I like these. These are cool. Like I was saying, I don't like how you can click numbers at the top of your keyboard and it will change the... Whatever it's called. Okay, should we make a... 
favorite color is red. We're going to have to make a red wand. I'm sorry, guys, but like, I hope you understand because that's the wand we're making, at least for now. And we needed three of these, I think, three sticks. Let's go ahead and make living twigs and put our red wand. Oh, the red doesn't look too nice. Oh, too late now. Let's come over here and we'll harvest up all of this living wood. I need a faster axe. I'm going to go ahead and make a diamond axe once this one breaks. It's not that it's slow, it's just not fast, and it's a pain to have to wait and slowly mine all of this living wood. It's not even that slow, but still. Just be happy I'm not punching it with a sword, guys. I mean, huh? yeah, get it, see? Okay, let's go get the gold. So how much gold do we have by now? Oh, plenty. Let's have, we have a crafting table here. So it was the shards, then the gold ingots, and then the living wood, if I'm not mistaken. And we can't make eight, so we'll make four. Okay, lots of clicking. So we have our mana spreaders, and we have our wand of the forest. So theoretically, we should be able to... Actually, no, let's quickly read this and generating flora day bloom so how do i get it to make mana uh not reading about that who don't want the i don't want a story i want to know how to use it so i guess what we could do is put a mana spreader here oh look there's something inside of it and now if we click it with the wand of the forest Oh, is that actually holding stuff? It may be. Yeah, I think it may be. Let's put our mana pool down here. Is that doing something? Um, sparring mana, accepting mana from items. Oh, wow, what is that doing? Um, how do I get it to rotate like it did? I give up. Let's mine it. If I put it this way, will it give mana? It looks like it does. Right? Yeah, it looks like it's giving mana to this thing. How do I check to make sure? How do I make sure it's getting... There's a brain slime over there. Mana manipulations. What was that? I don't... E I give up. There's so many weird... Ah, uh, it's working. Get away from me. Get away from me again. Doubly. Just get... I hate brain slimes. They're so annoying. What is that? Is that the mana? Th I hope that's the mana thing. Okay, well, we're making mana. We have a very basic setup here, but it's, it's working. Well, that's really cool. Okay, next, we we crafted our day blooms, and yeah, that's really cool. So, we've crafted our day blooms, we have made our wand, of, the, of course here's the wand of the forest, so would it even, yeah, it shows you how to, wow, what's terra steel? Oh, I think we actually found some of this, it would, uh... I don't even know. Okay. Terra Seal is a complex magical alloy infused with a great amount of mana. Conjuring it proves not to be a small task. For starters, to create it, one would require a terrestrial agglomeration plate set on top of a checkerboard pattern of lapis lazuli and living rock. Mana would need to be provided to this block. Sparks would be the most effective way. Don't even know what those are. Rune of mana? I don't... Uh, after the plate is set up and ready to receive mana, tossing a single mana steel ingot, mana diamond, and mana... This is insane! Picking up any of these items will halt the infusion, causing severe mana loss. The infusion uses half a mana pool total to create a single piece. Multiple sparks would make it go faster, too. Really? Do I really need... Oh, I haven't made this yet. Is that really the basic... I don't... No, I give up. We're not going to make that this episode. Let's go ahead and instead look at functional flora. I want to craft a bell thorn, I think, which is the one that uses like utilizing mana and slowly inflicts harm. Ooh, that's good. Next page. 
So we need redstone roots, red mana petals, cyan mana petals. How do I make a redstone root? Previous page, bat. I give up with that stupid thing. Miscellaneous, is it in here? Nope. Is it going to be under functional flora, maybe, if I'm lucky? Nope. Is it natural apparatus? It doesn't look like it. What about baubles? Nope. And what about, uh, no, mystical items? Not as far as I can tell. This is much more difficult than I thought it would be. Lexicon. Basics, maybe? No. Okay, well, how do you make a redstone root, NEI? There we go. And there's no- oh, there is- oh, we just need grass and redstone. That's really easy. We have shears, too. Let's just grab some grass. I love how I just continually destroy the area outside of my house. Compound base thing. I, I, you guys saw the description for the video the other day. It was literally just whatever sort of name I call this place, I'm just gonna go with. I need normal Minecraft grass. So let's just, we'll make 32. I think that's a good number. Uh, I want those seats though. And I want these seats too. And these seats. And I don't want that iris. Okay. And then we'll come downstairs. We'll grab some redstone. I hope none of, not all of it got exploded. No, we still have a good amount. Let's just merge that stack. And let's craft some redstone root. Cool. And now what we need to do is go to functional flora, bellthorn, and it's red flowers, cyan flowers, water buckets. So let's go upstairs quickly and just grab some water. I'm really hoping that we'll get to test it out tonight. So we'll make, how many should we make? So cyan, where are cyan flowers? Cyan, we'll get two of and we'll get three red flowers. We will make cyan flowers. Let's go ahead and craft this. It's not working. Oh, we redstone root. There we go. And now if I toss the seeds in, how do I get it to go in? Why is this not working? We have the red. We have the... What else does it need? Red mana petal. Shift click to see recipe. Ah, oh, we did it wrong. How do I get items out? I just right click. Okay guys, so we're gonna have to learn how to make mana petals and not just pink petals. Okay, so my guess is that we just, oh, let's go ahead and sleep. So in the morning, we will make some nice new groovy mana petals.